Flying around in this game is just so, like, soothing. But welcome back to an episode four of the Hardcore. Is it episode four? It's episode four already, yes. Of episode four. If you guys haven't seen last episode, we got a little bit of an iron farm going here. Now, I haven't actually been on the world since. So we got 35 iron. That's pretty good, I suppose. Uh, considering I haven't been on this world at all since last episode. What I want to do this episode is find a village and I want to start a raid. Now, a lot, some things that I want to get done, I want to try and get done in this episode, would be to also do some buildings, which would be nice. It'd be nice to build a building around this. I mean, I yeah, it should be fine. I just have to build a really big, bulky building for it, but... So those are some ideas that I have for this video. Um, so let's get started on some of those things real quick. Okay, so while I have some stone smelting, uh, which is cool and all, it's gonna take a very long time to get a few stacks melted. So what I wanna do is take my little trusty silk touch here and add I guess I can add a break into that I have an efficiency book up here which I've been saving for a while oops and is that the cheap is gonna go yes oops there we go so efficiency for mending I'm gonna add that to the silk touch and I'm gonna go down below and just grab a bunch of cobblestone which will be then stone which is what I'm gonna be using for my build It's like a thunderstorm out here. It's all I can hear. So, this is what I got so far, which is pretty good. I, I think that's enough stone. It should be, at least for a building. I guess that's uh. Okay, this should be enough stuff to kind of get it started. So let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go get it started. Alright, so this isn't looking too bad, I suppose. I think I'm going to do white concrete up top. Um, this looks pretty good, I think, you know? I don't think it's too bad. Let's add some lights in here. So, let me go get some white concrete, which I believe is the sand. I think it's sand and gravel, and you mix it with white dye, which I have plenty of bones. So, that's possibly the easiest way to do it. I just think that I like the look of a uh, white, brown, and uh, gray. So now I should have up here. There's still water flowing. Yeah, that looks pretty. Oh, what? Huh? Why did, why did a concrete block just fall out of the sky? Now, one thing that's going to be very, very annoying is the roof. It's very large. Now, something that is a huge flaw in my uh, of building is I suck really badly at trying to build roofs. So, building a roof for this size is probably going to come out looking quite dumb. However, that's uh, it's a problem for a different time. This is what uh, one side looks like. And, um, you know what? Doesn't look that bad. It... It's actually quite doable. Uh, <laughs> there is a massive hole in the middle, which is going to be quite irritating to fill up. But you know what? Hey, it looks half done. Uh, I got to do the other side now. Boom. Not bad. Not bad at all. I just got to find a way to fill up this ginormous gap. <laughs> and voila okay that's that's that, that makes up it looks a little nicer now yeah i can deal with that all right now i just got to do that exact same design on the other side i think i think it came out okay obviously i still got to put windows in it but you know i just want to get a last little 
peek at it, you know? It looks looks pretty good. Let's go over to the back here. Ow. Separate little design because we don't have the door, so it's not two little pillars going up of spruce. But, you know, we got the window up there. I think it ties in pretty nicely, I suppose. All right, all the windows in, ladders in, come down just like this. Boom, got a little spot. I built this farm. I know there's a much faster ones that can get you like a thousand a minute, like crazy amount of numbers of iron. I don't need all that. I just wanted something so that if I needed iron for hoppers or any kind of redstone project, whatever it may be, that I had access to it. What happened to you? Alright, so I want to come down here because I want to fix this. Alright, so I should have this fixed. So when villagers, let me turn this on. So now we should start getting breeding to come down here. Because I want to get a trading hall done quite soon, possibly this episode. Uh, so getting them... Uh, getting them started down there would be great. So... Let's wait for them to kind of breed up a little bit. What is this? Oh, that. Ow. Well, well, well. Right next to a village, too, which is perfect. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, Where's Buddy at? I need to kill. Got it. All right, now let's take it over to this village. <laughs> oh my. These guys with the axes, those who I gotta watch out for. Those will take me out instantly. Don't kill all the villagers. I completely forgot that I need to be alive for me to get savior of the village or whatever the hell it's called. Go inside. Is he after me? Oh, he's after me. Why is he? A Did I hit him? I think I accidentally hit him. I will protect you. away <laughs> who's left just this big guy two okay Where's the last guy? What'd you just hit me with? Slowness? Wait, this guy's not dead? Hey, boo. How long is on this poison? Oh, gosh. Oh, they're killing the villager! Ow. Come here. Sleep. I gotta clean my inventory. Why do I got so much junk? Here's a totem. Now, put that in my offhand. 
How many waves are left? Oh my god. Oh, did I? Oh, I did the victory. Okay, let's go. I just gotta deal with these little turds. Alright, there we go. Hero of the village. I don't know how many people are left, but not too shabby, I suppose. Now I'm also very far from home, so I think. What direction do I gotta go in? I wanna say this direction. I know there's people that make like those raid farms where all you gotta do is sit there and just get a bunch of XP and whatever else, but I don't really have any uh, intention on building stuff like that. Home sweet home. The next project will be right here. I think it's better time than any. Let's start building a villager trading hall when it stops raining. All right, so I decided to clean out a bunch of area here and I come into this chest. I got a bunch of stuff. I'm going to once again bring back the white concrete just like that. So it kind of ties in all together very nicely. For now, I'm going to just take some spruce, um, a bit of oak, and just start messing around with the design. And yeah, that shouldn't be too bad. I Right? And... Okay, yeah, I kind of like that. I got to... I have like... Okay. I got to continue the stairs that are upside down here. Got to continue that pattern. And then... Obviously, I got to finish the roof, but... I actually kind of like that. I think I got to make some sort of entrance, which might be like the side here, like... This would be like a perfect entrance like this. I think it I think it'll be fine. And then I'll have a small little second floor where I'll stuff something up there. But yeah, this is kinda of what it starts to look like. Looking pretty good. I like it though. Up there's a little bit, you know, detailed list. But I got so much junk on me. But, uh, yeah, it actually looks pretty good. Alright, that looks, uh, pretty good. Hello. Okay, chill, chill, chill. Okay. I want them to shoot their leader. Shoot your own leader, so I don't get your omen. Okay. Alright. This is what it looks like. Final product. I just realized it's not final product. I, I didn't do the floor. That's fine. I'll do it soon. Um, got the walls all built. I think I'm going to add some, like, maybe flower pots or something around the place. But we got the front door. Come on. I got to be careful because there were mobs spawning in here. So I had to put little lanterns. But I'll add a floor-ish up here. But, yeah, this is what it kind of looks like. It looks pretty good. You know, everything all blended in. It's not too, uh, not too shabby. Let's land up here. Looks, uh, and I made sure to do all sides the exact same. I didn't leave anything, so both, even that far side, I guess would be the left side or whatever side you want to call it, uh, is also done as well. All right, so I've decided that I want to waste all of my iron <laughs> on creating anvils for railings inside of the, oh my lord. So I need a total of 56, so it's going to take a lot of iron, but you know what? Worth it. All right, I got all 56, and I have 24 iron. Nothing too exciting. You know, looks pretty good. I add a little upstairs here, 
which is where these will come handy. Um, even though I'm probably never ever going to come in here. Oh, that's, that's so loud. All right. I guess I, I, I counted one extra, but you know what? I need it for a pop the XP farm. This is what it looks like, you know? Looks pretty good. I'll probably add some chandeliers coming down and whatever else I care to add, but I feel like that looks pretty good. I might even add, because in these little spots here, would work for extra villagers. So I could do that. I could also add these into windows and just put the villagers back here. That way there's an actual reason to come inside, which would also be much easier than trying to stick them right here in this window. So I think I'll actually end up doing that. I'll probably stick them here. So, but that's kind of what I got done. I don't feel like moving them right now. That's a project for next time. Hello. Looks pretty good. So uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like and I'll see you guys uh, oh, later. Peace.